Hello everyone, this is Lillian and it's time for our three minutes with the word audio devotional. Today's topic is not sudden and our anchor scripture is taken from the book of Acts chapter 16 verses 25 and 26. Around midnight, Paul and Silas were praying and singing hymns to God and the other prisoners were listening. Suddenly, there was a massive earthquake and the prison was shaken to its foundations. All the doors immediately flew open and the chains of every prisoner fell off. We have been on the, uh, on the Acts 16 story of Paul and Silas in jail. And the last day we spoke about how using their mouths, they created a sound in the darkest hour of the night, right there in the midst of their captivity. The Bible records in verse 26 that there was a sudden massive earthquake that led to a series of happenings that eventually culminated in their freedom and release from prison. But today, I want us to interrogate that word suddenly. You see, whether we are believers in Jesus or not, there are two planes of existence, the spiritual realm and the physical realm. On the authority of scripture, we know that things manifest in the physical only after they have first happened and are ratified in the spiritual. So the Bible tells us that Paul and Silas were praying and praising in the physical and suddenly in the physical, there was a reaction. This reaction that happened suddenly in the physical was not a sudden reaction in the spirit. The instant they started singing and praying and praising, a reaction began in the spirit realm. A bubbling commenced. Momentum started building. Things began to happen. In the physical, nothing changed. The dungeon was just as dark. The chains ate deeper into their flesh. The pains from the beating stung even more. Nothing changed for the better. In the spiritual, however, like I said, a bubbling had started. As they sang, momentum was building. As they prayed, things were being arranged. When their worship and prayer had reached a particular level in the spiritual, it was no longer possible for the physical realm not to comply with what was happening in the spiritual. So that crescendo that was reached in the spiritual manifested as a suddenly in the physical. My point to you today is this, do not stop. Do not stop praising because you praised and saw no result. There are measurements in the spiritual realm and once you attain to this measurement, there will be an intervention in your physical circumstances. It is inevitable. Some people listening to me started singing and praying but got discouraged because the night seemed to get darker and the bondage seemed not to be responding. Every time you stop out of discouragement, you hinder the possibility of your suddenly. These guys set their eyes, their hearts, and their minds on God, not on the bondage, on God, and continue to fire on until heaven responded. I bring you a charge. The situation is still there anyway, so ignore it. Focus on the Lord and release fire on your captivity through cons- constant and consistent praise and worship. Do not stop until suddenly happens. I await your testimony. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you so much for your word. Continue to take all the glory, almighty God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Speak to you again soon. If you are blessed, please drop me a line on audio devotional at yahoo.com or on our website at www.3minutesaudiodevotional.com. You could also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter at 3 Minutes Audio Devotional. Remember, wrapped up in God's word is all you need. For your change to come. Love you and bye.